Jiro, what have you got for us today? Steven's Magic exclusive uh, in the United States. Um, Alakazam Magic put this out with uh, Liam Levinon, I think is his name. Incredible idea. Um, it is, you have a spectator do the magic. They are going to memorize the entire deck. I'm going to push through the deck and you're going to memorize, or you're going to see some things and we're going to see at the end if you can memorize some things. So I'm just going to push through like this. Okay, just memorize them. Don't, don't like do it too heavy, but you might see something out of whack and maybe you won't. Um, right there. Oh, oh, did you see something yeah, interesting? there's a card backwards. There's a card backwards. Mm -hmm. Okay, but you were looking at the other cards too, right? Right, right, yeah. So if you were to say, there were, uh, did you see more face cards or more uh, number cards? Number cards. You saw more number cards. Yeah. So that means most likely that it's a face card turned upside down. Mm -hmm. Did you see, do you think you didn't see one of the cards? Just out of a whim, if you could guess, one of the face cards mm -hmm. you didn't see? I didn't see the king of spades. You did not see the king of spades. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Because I think there was, you, you saw one flipped card, right? Yeah. Just one, Just right? One, yeah. Yeah. And uh, this card right here, the only flipped card is the King wow. of Spades. <laughs> wow, that's good. Yeah, and guys, you're going to love it. I was able to learn this like six minutes out of the box. If you guys know uh, the Invisible Principle, it's sort of like that. But at the very end, you can hand out some cards and they get a look at it, which you'll never be able to do with an Invisible deck which makes it 10 times cooler. Um, yeah, and so I hope you guys check it out.